200%. Welcome to the program. This is your captain, Trainer Tia, coming to you with your intro video, telling you a little bit about what this program is, what to expect, how it's going to work, key parts of it, and all that jazz. If you did 200% last year in 2022, this is going to be pretty similar. So maybe just put it on in the background, you know, while you're doing dishes or uh, on your run or bike or whatever. If you're brand new to 200%, then definitely watch this whole thing. It won't take long. It'll be about 10 minutes long. Um, and you'll get the rundown for how it works. So by the time you're getting to this video, you're likely in the Facebook group and hopefully on the app at some point soon, if not already before this program. So let's talk about those two things first. So the app is where you're gonna get your daily workouts, okay? And within each workout, be sure to read the notes on each section. You'll see like within each section on the app, there'll be a little notepad at the top right corner. Make sure that you read those notes every single time. And, and, and because there's, there's important information there explaining rep schemes or what have you. So be sure to read the notes every single time. Um, and the app will have all of the workouts, all of the technique demonstrations, all of the reps and sets and directions and all of that. So you're going to operate out of the app for the most part. However, there's also a Facebook group component and the Facebook group, I would argue is your accountability piece. It's one of the more important pieces of this program because that's what most people are missing. Right? People typically come to me, a trainer, for one of two things. They come to me for either knowledge or accountability. Knowledge is like learning what to do, when to do it, how often to do it, how heavy to do it, um, all that stuff. Right, But the accountability is arguably a bigger piece. This is why people work with me for many, many years is because they like having me on their program, checking in with them, um, verifying that they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. And the Facebook group is the way that we do that. So even though you're going to be working out of the app each day, what I ask people to do is to comment each day on the corresponding workout graphic in the Facebook group. For example, if day one is bench press day, uh, you'll see in the Facebook group day one, week one, bench press, da da da, da and you'll comment on that graphic with how your workout went. This is really important. And I think a lot of people don't do this enough. Be sure to comment and check in. First of all, I'm just doing my job. If I don't hear from you for a little bit, I will reach out to you personally, which creates more work for me, which then, you know, it's like good cop, bad cop. I'm like looking out, you know, uh, where are you? Are you doing the program? It, it makes it easier if you just stay involved and let me know how it's going. So comment each time after you do your workout. It could be just like done. I like a little more feedback than that. Like, hey, I progressed on this. This is getting better. This is really tough for me. This is how I'm feeling. Anything like that. Um, the more that you give me, the more that I can help, right? And on that note, another big feature of this program is the technique videos. Please take advantage of the technique videos, even though you submitting your technique videos makes more work for me. And it's like a nice kind of benefit, I guess, when people don't do the technique videos, I want you to succeed. Okay. I want you to improve your technique. Better technique means more strength. More strength means you're more fulfilled, you're seeing progress, you're happy with the program. It's it's just better for everybody if your technique is good. Um, and not to mention injury prevention, right? Better technique means less likely to be injured. So one of the best features of working with me in a remote program like this is the ability to verify technique. So post your technique videos each day on that workout graphic as well. And since the, the group is gonna be relatively small this time, I'm just going to open it up, post as many technique videos as you want. You could, you could take snippets of each exercise at your top set, your heaviest set of each exercise, and you could post four videos a day. Um, I'm okay with that at this point. If that gets out of control, if everybody's participating really well, I might have to limit that down to three or two videos per day. But for now, I want you to post as many little snippets of your top set of each exercise as you can on the corresponding Facebook graphic, because then I can check it and I'll be like, okay, make sure your chin's down. Uh, stick your hips, hips out more. Um, when you stand up, do this, uh, break the bar. Let's talk about how to do that more, right? There's, there's so much to be gained in the feedback, uh, uh, from techniques. So, so please take advantage of that. It is to your benefit. Yes, it makes more work for me, but I want you to succeed. And, and that's a big piece of it. Okay. So there's some details about program structure. So what, what can you expect in this program as far as lifts, frequency, reps, sets, uh, exercises, all of that. 
So, so first and foremost, to get stronger, the key word is repetition. Repetition, right? So you're gonna see repeats each week of some of the key exercises. Don't fight the repetition. Repetition is the fastest path to mastery and the fastest path to progress as well. So if you're benching several times per week, see it as an opportunity to go deeper with that technique as opposed to broader with more exercises. That's really how you get stronger as you go deeper with the more transformative lifts like bench, squat, deadlift, pull up, overhead press, etc. And that's really how we drive strength is focusing on those big lifts. Okay, so frequency is a hallmark of this program and we're gonna focus on 10 key lifts and I will send that out in the initiation document and also on the first post um, for the goals. And so 10 key lifts we're gonna focus on, we're going to repeat those multiple times per week in order to drive progress and mastery. Don't fight the repetition, lean into it, look at it as a way to get better faster. Right, so repetition number one. Number two, everything will be in supersets. A superset is two sets, two exercises back to back, right? So bench press and king squats or something like that. Bench press and king squats, back to back. So while you're resting bench press, you're working king squats. While you're resting king squats, you're working bench press and going back and forth. This is to maximize your time. Um, ideally, in a perfect world, if you were a, competi a competition power lifter, you would have two to four minutes between every single set, one exercise at a time. That's elite strength though. Most people aren't after that. Um, at this level, we are able to get rest on exercise one while we work exercise two in an, in an effort to get as much in in the limited time that we all have to be spending in the gym. So supersets are another key feature of this program. Everything will be in supersets to maximize your time. And what else can I tell you? So at the end of each day, you're going to get an abs and core, I'm sorry, abs and arms blast. Meaning you're gonna see a superset or two of buys, tries, and abs, right? And so this program promises to double your strength with an asterisk, right? Double your strength while you chisel arms and abs. So that's how we're gonna do it. We're going to hammer the key lifts with high frequency and repetition in a superset format. And we're gonna hit arms and abs at the end of each, um, each day as well. The arms and abs is optional. If you want to work on arms and abs, throw it in at the end. If you're pressed for time and you have to cut something out, do the workouts in order as they are in order of importance and then cut out the arms and abs at the end because you're gonna see plenty of that throughout anyway. On that note, I have some people who are like, I can't do five lifts a week. Can I still do this program and do three or four lifts a week and then just work through? Absolutely. So, so just keep going through the lifts in order right? Like don't do three of week one and then skip four and five and then three of week two and skip four and five, right? Keep going through in order. Um, and then at the end of the, the workout or the, the program period, you are able to keep the app for just 10 bucks a month. And then you'll have access to all the workouts, all your notes, all your record keeping, all that as well. So that's an option for you if you can't quite hit the full frequency at five per week. Um, what else? Let's see. Um, I don't think I have anything else to say on the exercise piece. We talked about Facebook. Oh, as far as communication, I would prefer to keep all of our communication through the Facebook group. So if you can, don't email me, don't text me. It just makes it cleaner for me when I'm like, okay, I'm ready to work on 200%. I can sit down and all my messages are right there rather than me having to grab them from in-app messaging, text messaging, email, right? So, so if you have a question, post it in the Facebook group, post it on the graphic that it corresponds to, and I will get to it within 24 hours. I check the group every morning and every night. During the afternoon, I'm with my clients and doing my own workouts. So late morning, early afternoon is, is when I'm not available typically. Um, but if I, I do check and reply usually in the morning and definitely at night every single day. So, so I am here. If it takes me a couple hours to get back to you, it's not personal, um, just with my clients. Um, let's see, what else? Um, as far as doubling your strength, right? Like this program will be most effective for somebody who's new. So, so the double your strength, the 200%, the name of this program is gonna really apply the most to somebody who is on the newer end of the spectrum. So if you're experienced, if you've done this program before or my programs before, or you've been lifting for a little bit, you may not see a 200% increase, but you should increase based on just the structure of this program alone. So, so don't be sad if you don't quite double everything progress is progress. And the more progress that you make, the harder progress is to come by, 
right? As you get better and better, the, pro the, the road to gains becomes steeper and steeper and harder and harder, right? Just a product of experience. So keep that in mind if you're more experienced, the gains might not come as easily or as big, but you are still making progress, which is valuable. Okay, um, I think that's everything. This felt like very logical and, 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 and um, dry, just talking about the details of the program. I just wanna say as well, I am always appreciative of people that get into my programs. There's There are a few things that bring me as much joy as sharing my passion, which is strength training and the weight room and fitness with people who wanna learn. So I just wanna say thanks to everybody who has joined for trusting in me to handle your fitness needs. And um, I know that in my technique videos and in maybe in this video and in some communications, I can come across as like harsh and direct but I promise uh, I, I'm here to help. I wanna help. Ask me any questions that you have. You'll get out of this what you put into it. If you stay in touch, if you ask questions, if you post technique videos, if you interact with the group, it's gonna be such a better, richer experience for you. The people who fall off and don't communicate and half-ass it and they're the people that don't enjoy the program as much and don't get as much out of it, right? So stay in touch, communicate with me, answer the weekly summaries that I ask for um, and post those technique videos. And, and the more that we're connected, the more you're gonna get out of this program. So, so you get what you give. So um, I think that's everything, everybody. I don't have anything else to say. Uh, I, I, again, thank you guys for joining this program. I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna throw some new twists in this year that we didn't see last year. Um, namely things like forced reps, timed reps, um, and some more tricks more than just tempo manipulation, which is what we focused on last year. So um, I'm thrilled, let's get it going. Um, and, and I'll be in touch. You'll have everything that you need, including the initiation document and the uh, first week of workouts by Sunday night this week. Sunday is, what day is Sunday? Uh, the 26th. So by Sunday PM, you should have everything that you need. If by the time you're watching this video, you don't yet have app access, email me, text me, let me know, and I need to get you up and running with that. App access and Facebook group access are number one. Waivers coming out this weekend, um, sign the waiver, and then like I said, you'll have the rest of the materials by Sunday at the latest. Um, and then each week, you'll typically get at least the next day, Monday of workouts by Sunday night, or the whole week of workouts by Sunday night if I'm really on top of my game and I don't have a ton of work that day. So, so, so usually workouts will be updated by 24 hours before um, or so. Usually, the, I mean, always the day before at the very latest. So, okay, that's enough. I've talked enough. Let's get to it. 200%, go hard, send those technique videos, do your best. And I am looking forward to seeing all of your progress along the way. All right, guys, have a great weekend. Talk to you on Sunday.